Hey, do nuts, new apartment, and you know what that means. You should know what that means. Come on, I live in a new place and I want to do something to show it off, and it rhymes with compartment sewer. But it looks and smells a lot better. Sometimes. So welcome to the new place. I figured I'd start where any sensible tour guide would start, the laundry room. Or, in this case, the laundry hole in the wall. You know, I wanted this to be my bedroom when I moved in, and the leasing agent said, wouldn't you be a little cramped in there? And I said, you should have seen my bedroom as a child. And then she cried and hugged me. A little inappropriate for a first time meeting, but I think I know why she was hitting on me. Anyone who feels entitled to a bedroom this big probably comes from money. Gold diggers, am I right? Gonna have to watch that. Speaking of my bedroom, this is the kitchen. I am rarely in here. Usually my stuffy butler Pickles does anything that needs doing in here, but I am here now because I have been waiting for minutes. Yes, four minutes. F-O-R, not four minutes. Two or three max, but that's still too long to be waiting for another beer. Apparently there is something wrong with the refrigerator. He opened it and he ran out screaming something about a Mesopotamian demigod. I, I don't know. Anyway, I need a beer. Who are we going to call? Maintenance, of course. This is my room of morning preparation. Yes, there's a shower and toilet and a sink, but really all I need in the morning is this. The Swanson Pyramid of Greatness. If you don't have one, you should trade one of your more expendable bathroom appliances for one like your toilet. On with the compartment sewer. This is the living room where I do my dying because irony. But don't worry, I'm not doing it any faster than any of you. We're all getting closer with every minute of every day. <laughs> Moving on. These are my bookshelves. Not everything on here is mine though. Some of it belongs to my roommate. Mostly books though. <laughs> Nerd alert. Not the cool stuff though. Like my Anakin Skywalker lightsaber. <laughs> It makes sounds like in the movies. So cool. This room was going to go to Pickles, but I gave him the laundry hole in the wall. He works there, so no more commuting all the way across the apartment for him. I really am too good to him. Anyway, this room belongs to Kelsey now. She's the new roommate. I think you've met her before. Actually, I think she might be here. I saw her like half an hour ago going into the kitchen. Hmm. Seamless transition to my bedroom. This is where I do all of my most serious thinking. I'm not in here a lot. Things have been great since my last video. I got a new job, a better job than the last one. I'm back in Indy now. I'm editing for How to Adult and The Happy Family Show. Basically, my life continues to be better than I deserve. What's been happening with all of you in the last two and a half months? Put it in the comments. You know I love to stay in touch. Thanks as always just for watching and keep doing what you do. I feel strongly about organization. I would rather live in a germy, dirty apartment that is perfectly organized than a clean but completely disheveled living space. Like, when I see an unnecessary lack of organization, I have this quiet rage that builds inside me and tells me that someone needs to be severely punished for that, which I'm sure is totally normal.